that Meghan Markle wants it off, and so do most of the public over here in the United Kingdom. It's one of the most requested things that has recently been asked of the well, British monarchy as ever. Let me explain. Morning, lovely to see you today. Thank you so much for taking the time out to join me. Hope you're all well. Welcome one and all brand new subscribers. Lovely to have your company. How are you having a nice time? Why, what are you doing? And that's the thing, isn't it? <laughs> yes, I know. I'm thinking to myself, yes, I should have put more, I should have brought the bigger flask out. You know what I'm saying? I know, just resent having to pay those coffee prices and stuff like that. I mean, I don't know about you, even just sitting down now for a cup of coffee somewhere, it's so expensive, isn't it? And they never make it the way that you like it. Yeah, you know what I mean? You're with me, aren't you? That's why I prefer to take a flask. A lot of people that see me out and about in London, you know, are literally stunned. They think I make these things up. I don't. I've always got flask and a few bickies. Why waste your money in a cafe? Sit on a bench if it's nice or find somewhere under a shelter. You know, save your money. It doesn't have to be wasted in a coffee shop. Do you know what I'm saying? If it's a treat and you're meeting a friend, that's all right, isn't it? Back as ever to your old story of the day. Interesting in this because as we know, Meghan and Harry were very hastily demoted from the royal website. It didn't go down well at all, as one can imagine, with the former royals, simply because, as we told you before, Meghan and Harry basically felt that uh, her biog at least wasn't extensive enough. She's done far more, as we found out from her own extensive biog that she published herself, if you recall. Harry's was a little bit shorter, even though seemingly he would have had the more uh, interesting life to date there you go. Now what I find fascinating about this is, as we all now know, even though they were demoted on the Royal website, very graciously so it appears, His Majesty the King, King Charles III, has allowed the button to their website at the bottom, you know, where you can click on and find out more about the Sussexes. Now one would expect a little bit of gratitude, and as I told you before, seemingly that hasn't come their way. You see, apparently Meghan and Harry are not quite sure exactly whether they want people to click on from that website. Website. Some might suggest, and as ever we have to say allegedly, that they may feel this is monitoring their traffic. You get the picture. <laughs> Spooky or what? But over here in the United Kingdom, the bigger issue is that, and this is one of the biggest complaints that has happened about the Royal website, they don't want it. You know, the public feel that it's demeaning to that website. It should only be about the British Royal family. Yes, their biogs could stay on if they want, right at the bottom, one might suggest, but of course, having a button to access what they're doing, which is very dangerous when you think from a popular website, because one doesn't know what they're going to be doing next. So allowing a free link to something that might not necessarily be in line with the morals and values of the British monarchy is very dangerous indeed. Someone I've been told at the top suggested this was a nice pleasant idea to keep it on ton cordial as they often say. But seemingly for Harry and Meghan they too think that this possibly is now not the right idea. Either way, whatever you're doing, it's wrong, so it would appear. And those that are trying to appease the situation with the wearing Sussexes and, of course, senior members of the British monarchy, well, once again, it appears it's a time to either push the button or remove the button. Either way, people over here in the United Kingdom would like the latter. I'd love to know what you think to this particular news story of the day. As ever, please like and share. Be respectful in the comments. Neil Sean in the very heart of London.